I don't let the opinions of others really influence how I think about myself. And that took a long time because in the early part of my career, I did, and it made me feel really bad about myself. So I came out and I had, my first song went to number one and my first album went to number one and my first movie went to number one. I was like, yo, I'm killing it. And then everybody was like, she can't sing, she can't dance, she can't act, she is just a pretty face or her butt is big or whatever they were saying about me. And I started thinking, yeah, that's true. And it really hurt me for a long time. And then I started realizing, I just kept going. You asked me what I did, I, despite the hurt and the pain, I just kept going. And I just couldn't allow myself to let that become who I was. I was like, no, I'm gonna make another record. I'm gonna make another song. I'm gonna make another movie. I'm, I'm a great actress. I'm a great singer. I'm a great dancer. I'm great at this stuff, and I'm gonna keep going. And I did, and that's all I did. I just kept going, and I just started working harder and harder than everybody else. And I saw that I was working harder than everybody else, and, and it started paying off. But more than that, I started believing in myself. I started believing in the fact that I wasn't imposter, that I wasn't a fake that there was a reason I kept doing this and people kept hiring me. It was like, okay, maybe I am good at this. It took time and it took me to believe in myself. Maybe that was happening because deep down I didn't believe. But once I started believing, and it was different people in my life at different times who were like, you are good at this. You, I would, cause then I'd go into the studios and be like, well, you know, I'm not a great singer, but, and they're like, what are you talking about? And I was like, well, you know, Whatever, you know, I don't sing like Aretha Franklin. And they're like, it doesn't matter. You sing like Jennifer Lopez and people love it. And I'm like, they do? And she's like, yes. And it's moments like that that you remember, that people just, they plant a seed for you to look at yourself in a better way. And it's those moments that just make you keep going. And it's just about, it's just like the movie, mm -hmm. like Maya. Mm -hmm her thinking that this mistake that she made when she was little made her, um, when she was young, that she didn't deserve any better for her life. And that's not true. Sometimes those mistakes lead you to your exact purpose and where you're supposed to be. And I think that for me, the most important thing is not listening to all the outside voices, but making sure that the voice that I'm speaking to myself, that roommate is a kind roommate, mm -hmm. is a good roommate is somebody who's always lifting me up like Elaine does every single day.